you are screaming at the top of your lungs and you know nothing's coming out. Anesthesia awareness is the experience of being awake and aware during a surgical procedure. Anesthesia awareness is considered to be a rare event, but rareness is relative and if one happens to be the patient who experiences anesthesia awareness, then it is not a rare event, it's totally consuming of their life. Awareness is believed to occur in about 21,000 of the 21 million patients who receive anesthesia each year, but experts agree that even one event is one too many. Driven in part by the national attention drawn to the topic by the recent release of the movie Awake, Stryker convened an expert panel of clinicians and patient advocates to outline a plan to reduce anesthesia awareness and improve patient safety. And so one of our goals today is learning how to discuss this topic effectively, how clinicians can do a better job, how technology can help, and how consumers and patients can play a more active role in the dialogue. We thought it was important to provide a platform for anesthesiologists or anesthesia providers to give a, a, an opinion from their standpoint surrounding the issue. According to panelists, the use of a brain function monitor during surgery can be a powerful ally to the anesthesiologist in helping to monitor and control anesthesia. Level of consciousness monitoring adds a new dimension to the monitors that we usually use in the conduct of anesthesia. The panelists were asked if they would want to have a level of consciousness monitor if undergoing surgery with general anesthesia. The response was unanimous, a resounding yes. And I would like to see them in, in every operating room and available for every surgery at the discretion of the patient and the uh, anesthesiologist. Carol Weir experienced anesthesia awareness while having eye surgery. Her message to the forum is focused on patient self-empowerment. I would encourage people who are about to undergo surgery to empower themselves with research and education about their surgery, about anesthesia. Working in cooperation with their patients and supported by an ongoing commitment to the development of effective new technology, clinicians are now in a stronger position than ever to ensure the best quality of care for their patients. Whether it's a nurse anesthetist or an anesthesiologist, and patient safety is our number one goal. This monitor provides additional information that nothing else in anesthesia monitoring does. I would encourage people who are about to undergo surgery to empower themselves. Because really, one case is one too many. And certainly as anesthesiologists, we're not going to stop until we get that uh, risk down to zero.